I'll admit it, we're pack rats. We just moved, and we have too much stuff. When you move into a smaller apartment from a bigger one, it's hard to deny it. Part of the reason why we have so much junk is because we like to make weird, arty stuff. When we moved, I realized we still had this giant canvas that we found in the alley. It's not blank, mind you. Here, check it out. It's huge. It's like, I don't know, four feet by four feet or something. See, now, if you look closer on the back, see it says to Gretchen from Jason Seavers, 95. It says it on this crossbar, too. To Gretchen from Jason Seavers. Now, here's the best part. Look at what's on it. We found it in the alley, and she said, Look at this awesome giant canvas. We can paint over it or something. We're not even painters, but it's a big canvas. Frankly, I think it needs to be painted over. Who is Gretchen? Who is Jason? And why would she just put it out in the alley like that? Ever since we've had it, we've been wondering, what is the true story of Jason and Gretchen? Uh, Gretchen, I thought maybe the best way to express how I feel is with my art, so I painted this for you. Uh, Jason, I don't know what to say. It's nice. Uh, sure is big, isn't it? My feelings are big right now. I mean, spending time with you has been so amazing. Like when we went and had pizza together the other day. You mean when I met you? Yesterday? Yeah, and like when I got here tonight, how you answered the door, it was like everything was so aligned. Everything was so right. Uh, maybe this wasn't such a good idea after all. What? What do you mean, Gretchen? Gretchen. I'm home. Jason, this is no good. You can't be here right now. What do you mean, Gretchen? I love you. Yeah, baby. What do you mean? And who is he? Gretchen, what is this? Who is he? My name is Albert. That's Fat Albert to you. P to the double H to the A-T. Honey, there's only one H in Fat. Girl, why are you always trying to stifle my creativity? There aren't any H's in fat. It's F-A-T. Gretchen, where did you find this guy? Well, after you left for duty in Iraq. One night, Albert and I had to work the Dairy Queen drive through alone together because everyone else called in sick. We got to talking and one thing led to another. And I'm human, Jason. I have needs, desires. She ain't lying about that. I didn't know if you were alive or dead or I couldn't just wither away alone forever. Gretchen, I've been gone for a week. Also, I kind of thought you were gay, too. I could have told you that myself. What do you mean? I don't know. There's just a way about you. Have you ever heard of Gaydar? Well, you just set it off for people. You ain't no Jean-Claude Van Damme, that's for sure. Shut up, Albert. Albert. Stay out of this. Okay, I did tell the army I was gay. But it was so they would send me back here to be with you. Well, what about the painting with the rainbow and everything? Gretchen, that rainbow is about our everlasting love and joy. Didn't it mean anything to you? Besides, the gay pride stripes has green, too. Oh, really? I didn't know there was a difference. I mean, how did you know that anyway? I don't know, I just did. That's not what's important. I think what's important is that you get to step in, Mr. G.I. Jason. Jason, I think you better leave. Gretchen, it's Valentine's Day, and I just, I wanted you to know how much I love you, so I made this painting. I mean, I don't have much money right now, so this is all I could do. I hope you like it. Jason, it's been three long years, and I'm getting tired. I'm tired of your paintings. I'm tired of you being late all the time. I'm tired of excuses. You need to find your talents. And it's not with a paintbrush, let me tell you that. I'm not always a patient woman, Jason. But I tried. I tried so hard. I gave you so many chances, Jason. 
Don't you remember what I said last Valentine's Day when you gave me a painting? I said, it's the last time, Jason. And I wasn't playing. That was the last time. This time, that's it. We're through. Because you know what? At the end of the day, I'm a woman, Jason. I got needs, desires. If you can't figure out how to fulfill my needs, and you ain't got any money, then what do you got? I'm sorry, but I think it's time you but better leave. Gretchen, but Gretchen, please, no. You can't do this to me on Valentine's Day. No. No. <laughs> Jason, I've given you too many chances. That's it. I think you just better get out and take that trifling painting with you. <laughs>